Today I'm going to show you how to make a really cool light bulb vase. We're going to use a screw fit light bulb and a wire coat hanger. We're going to start by putting on eye protection and a thick safety glove, then take a firm grip of the bulb and using some pliers remove the contact at the end of it. Next take a thin screwdriver, poke it through the hole and smash the glass cap off the end. Then, using our screwdriver, we're going to carefully smash through the glass seal into the bulb. Next, we need to open up the glass hole so it's large enough to remove all the loose content inside. Do this slowly and be very careful. Then, go ahead and empty out the contents. We now have an empty glass bulb vase. To make the stand, we're going to cut the hook off our wire coat hanger and straighten it out. Then we're going to cut it to a length of 60 centimetres and mark it into five equal sections of 12 centimetres. Next we need to bend it into a triangle at the points we've marked, then bend up the 12 centimetre upright and the 12 centimetre support bar. Next we're going to curl the end of the support bar by either using your pliers or by wrapping the bar around something until it's the right size for the bulb to screw into. This needs to be a good snug fit as we don't want the bulb to fall out. And there we have it, our simple light bulb vase. But if you want to make it really cool, we can actually make it light up. And to do this, we're going to use an LED keyring. Take it apart and remove the battery in the LED. As you can see, this one actually has two batteries, and they're too big to fit inside the bulb. So we're going to use three smaller watch batteries taped up end-to-end -end instead, with the LED taped on and bent to form a switch. Next, fix this inside the screw connector at the top of the bulb using some blue tack, and we'll use a screwdriver to switch it on and off. Pretty cool, hey? Remove it to fill the bulb up with water, then put back the batteries and LED and add some flowers. Thanks for watching.